Welcome to Health Bulletin. Did you know that pancreatic cancer is one of the most deadly types of cancer? Pancreatic cancer is often referred to as the silent killer, as it is often only detected at an advanced stage. This makes awareness of the warning signs absolutely paramount. It affects thousands of lives every year, causing devastating consequences. As per American Cancer Society's estimates for pancreatic cancer in the United States for 2024, it can affect 66 or 40 people, including 52% men and 48% women, will be diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, while mortality rate expected to rise by 52% in men and 47% in women. By the time they do cause symptoms, they have often grown very large or already spread outside the pancreas. Pancreatic cancer accounts for about 3% of all cancers in the US and about 7% of all cancer deaths. The average lifetime risk of pancreatic cancer is about 1 in 58 in men and about 1 in 60 in women. But each person's chances of getting this cancer can be affected by certain risk factors. Let's dive right into discussing the warning signs of pancreatic cancer and explore why its incidence is on the rise. But first, start with a quick anatomy lesson. The pancreas, a vital organ located behind the stomach, produces enzymes that aid digestion and hormones that regulate blood sugar levels. But unfortunately, it can also be a breeding ground for cancer. The first warning sign often ignored, abdominal pain that radiates to the back. If you're experiencing persistent and severe abdominal pain that spreads to your back, it could be a warning sign. Don't ignore it, as it could be an early indicator of pancreatic cancer. Symptom number two, Pancreatic cancer can also manifest in a visible way, jaundice. This condition turns the eyes and skin yellow, indicating a blockage in the bile ducts due to the tumor's growth. So if your skin and eyes appear dark yellow, it's a telltale sign that your liver and bile ducts may be affected. It's essential to understand that jaundice is not always related to pancreatic cancer. Jaundice can be caused by a variety of conditions, but it is also a prominent symptom of pancreatic cancer so it should be checked out promptly to rule out any potential risks. Symptom number three, unexplained weight loss. Although we all love shedding a few pounds, losing a significant amount without a change in diet or exercise should never be taken lightly. It could be a cause for concern. Pancreatic cancer often causes a loss of appetite and unintended weight loss. Symptoms number four, changes in stool color. Keep an eye out for pale or greasy stools. These changes in bowel movements can occur when your digestive system is not functioning properly due to pancreatic cancer. Symptom number five, new onset diabetes. If you suddenly develop diabetes, especially without any family history or other risk factors, it could be a sign of pancreatic cancer. The tumor has the potential to interfere with insulin production, which can result in irregular blood sugar levels. This chart reveals a fascinating correlation among those diagnosed with pancreatic cancer, one in four were initially diagnosed with diabetes. Red flag alert, number six, be aware of any family history and genetic factors related to pancreatic cancer, as these are significant risk factors. Pancreatic cancer has a strong hereditary component, as these are significant risk factors. If you have a family history of the disease or carry certain gene mutations, your risk increases significantly. The increasing incidence of pancreatic cancer can be attributed to various factors too. Like smoking, obesity, unhealthy diet and age are all known risk factors for this disease. Additionally, environmental toxins and certain workplace exposures may contribute to the rising numbers. Early detection is crucial for improving the prognosis of pancreatic cancer. If you experience any of these warning signs or have a family history, consult your healthcare provider immediately they can perform the necessary tests and screenings to catch the disease in its early stages. Remember, having one or more of the symptoms below does not mean you have pancreatic cancer. In fact, many of these symptoms are more likely to be caused by other conditions. Still, if you have any of these symptoms, it's important to have them checked by a doctor so that the cause can be found and treated if needed. By being aware of the warning signs and factors contributing to the surge of pancreatic cancer, trust me, it's better to be safe than sorry when dealing with the potential risk of pancreatic cancer. Thanks for watching. Together, let's raise awareness about this devastating disease and empower one another to take charge of our health.
Remember, knowledge is power. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more health-related content. Stay educated, stay healthy, 